My name is Brittany Monique Walker, and I'm a journalist. I've been a journalist for what? Would you say? Uh, for 10 years, and I've been primarily covering social justice issues. Can you hear me? Okay, social justice issues and travel. And when I travel, I love to get involved with the local culture, find that off the beaten path and hole in the wall spot that only the locals know about. And I'm not alone. I'm a part of a growing community of travelers, seven million plus strong. There's black folks traveling everywhere all the time, one to six times a year. And we're spending up to $50 billion. But when I spoke to my community, I found out that most people want these types of experience. They want to be immersed in the local culture. But there's something else that's, always ha that's happening as well. A lot of black people are still being discriminated against domestically and abroad when they're traveling. And there's not enough services out there to help us create this community of comfort. And so what I want to do, what I am doing, is launching Beyonder. Beyonder is a c experience curation service that connects black travelers with local black communities domestically and abroad. We've launched our first itinerary in Bed-Stuy around the wellness community. So travelers will go to Bed-Stuy and enjoy a beautiful yoga experience with a very curvaceous black woman who's very atypical yogi. She's not a skinny woman. And then you'll go off and to have a ginger beer tasting at a local um, juice spot where you'll learn about how this woman's been helping and healing people within her community. And finally, Travelers will visit a local urban farm where they'll learn how agriculture is changing the way uh, bed residents are taking control of their health. So we've launched our website at beyondertrips.com. Check it out. And there you can learn about you. You can learn about, <laughs> you can learn about bed -Stuy, and you can listen to the voices of the people who live there. So not only are, are we launching uh, itineraries, we also have podcasts where we'll be able to advertise and we're also launching events summer. And so because we're very anxious to get to our community, all these messages and products and services, we're launching our marketing campaign across social media. We're also launching our events, like I said, this summer. And we're thinking about partnering with some um, booking sites to offer our itineraries and experiences. And as we continue to build momentum, we believe that over the next few years will be quite profitable is simply on itineraries alone. That's not including the events or the podcast or even membership services. And over the next first year, or over the first year of our, of our founding, we're gonna be launching three new itineraries every quarter. We're gonna be in three new cities by the end of the year. And we're interested in partnering with key brands and like-minded brands like Z News Africa, whoop whoop, yeah. <laughs> and Inclusive. For those of you who don't know what inclusive is, inclusive is the clapback or the answer to Airbnb's discrimination issues. And so here's the team. We're a team of four, whoop, whoop. Uh, we've got a designer, two business advisors, and there's me. Like I said, I'm a journalist, and I've been traveling for a while. But over the past couple of years, I've been creating experiences for other black travelers. We've been going upstate and across the world together, creating these communities and connecting with great businesses and, and black services. And I would like to continue this service in a more scalable way through Beyonder. Check it out. You can book your first experience at beyondertrips.com. And if you sign up today, you'll be entered to win your first itinerary. Thank you.